Back to that breaking news from overnight. Two men arrested in connection with a deadly mass shooting at a nightclub in Orlando are booked into jail. But this morning, they are not being accused of murder. The shooting earlier this month at Glitz Ultra Lounge claimed the lives of two people and left nearly a dozen others hurt. News 6 reporter Kirsten O'Connor is live at the Orange County Jail this morning. And Kirsten, one of these men was actually arrested before, but released. Bridget, according to court documents, Jose Brule Lopez was arrested right after the shooting and then released on bond before police even told us that he was a suspect. But he's back in jail this morning facing new charges, and he's not alone. A second man is sitting in jail with ties to the deadly mass shooting that turned a nightclub filled with 300 people into a crime scene. 21-year-old Luis Cruz Nazario is charged with attempted murder, aggravated assault, illegally carrying a concealed weapon, and a whole list of charges. 23-year-old Jose Brule Lopez, the man arrested minutes after the shooting but later released, is back in handcuffs, charged with shooting into a structure. Now, you, sir, are ordered to have no weapons on or about your person as a condition of release. Brew Lopez's initial arrest was not released to the media until days later when he had already bonded out of jail. Hours after the shooting, police said there could be as many as three gunmen in the club that night. Police will not say now if they're looking for any other suspects, but are still investigating. The safety and the security of our residents and our visitors is the top priority of the Orlando Police Department. So again, neither one of these men is being charged with murder. That's the first question we're going to be asking police this morning and trying to get an answer to. We're also going to be trying to get a hold of that arrest report from that second arrest, and we'll post updates as we get them to our website, clickorlando.com, powered by News 6. Bridget? Thanks, Kirsten.